Mike Hughes here and I'm at Ocean's Eye and I'm here with Peter and Peter you're going to tell us a little bit about what you're doing. Yeah, thanks. Uh, so we're a citizen science company. Uh, we are launching here at DEMA. We've got a prototype of a device that divers can wear that will record scientific environmental conditions uh, while they're diving. Uh, really important stuff like temperature, depth, pH levels, light levels, things that uh, currently aren't recorded in most of the world's reefs. Okay. So we know very little about what the health of the planet's reefs are. Mm -hmm. We plan to change that by allowing every diver the opportunity to wear an Ocean's Eye device, which is something a little bit like this. This is still concept, but right. Uh, uh, we're looking to develop something like this that can be worn, it's small and compact. Uh, the information is uploaded to a smart device into the cloud and uh, the data is sent to our scientists who will then take that information and uh, process it, look for uh, hot spots in the world, look for good spots, bad spots, etc. Um, on top of that as well, uh, the Ocean's Eye will also create an amazing dive log in 3D for the diver as well, so with really uh, accurate uh, depth uh, readings. We've got uh, the ability to uh, show the dive profile in 3D as well. So instead of just seeing a dive line of where you are is, is your depth, we can actually now turn that into a 3D graph and you can map your entire dive. So we think that's going to be really cool. You're going to be able to tag photos to it and everything wirelessly as well, straight onto your smart device, straight after you go after you get out from Plus the Plus it'll give information, uh, historical information about Absolutely. A, a reef over time. That's exactly right. So we think there's going to be, it's, it's a, it's what the science world is needed. Currently, uh, I work for a research institute as well, uh, and there's just not enough data, and data is key. Mm -hmm. If we want to really fully understand what's happening with our oceans. Uh, uh, so how long do you, now we, you've got prototypes now, but how long before we have a um, mass marketing? So we're that? hoping that uh, as a result of the funding that we're getting, uh, launching from this uh, event, mm -hmm. uh, we're hoping that early 2017 to maybe summer of 2017, we'll have uh, the ability to launch to the public a full working device uh, ready to use on any reef around the world. Okay, and if they don't want to wait to 2017 and they want to find out more, you go to um, seacrowd.org, uh, you can uh, jump onto our crowdfunding uh, page from there as well, help us out by ordering some pre-orders of the uh, Ocean's Eye device, mm -hmm. and uh, we will then ship them out to you as soon as we start developing them in early 2017. And then go diving. <laughs> and then go diving, absolutely. All right. Well, thank you very much. Thank you very time. much.